Turning to local news now, Idaho Falls Planning and Building Citizens Review Committee is working on a set of recommendations that they will eventually present to the City Council. Well, tonight they met. They're looking over some of their ideas, and Local News 8's Tadavik Aprikian was there, joins us now in the studio. Tadavik, what'd you learn? Well, Carol, the hope was to put forth eight to ten recommendations for the city council, but the committee only got through a couple of them this evening. One of the first items they unanimously agreed on was to upgrade the technology for the planning and building department. The committee is proposing a software update to existing city technology, as well as getting mobile devices like laptops or iPads to city workers. They say this will save time and money. What they're doing is they're spending a lot of time out in the field uh, looking at properties, particularly in the building permit side, and then having to come back to the office. And so we're, our idea is to get them out in the field uh, so they spend less time uh, in the office, more time out in the field with some technology pieces, mobile devices. One of the other topics that took up a large portion of this meeting was on daycare. Right now, overseeing daycare regulations falls under the Planning and Building Department. One member said Idaho Falls is one of the few cities where daycare is regulated at the city level. Most other places, it's regulated by the state. Tonight's discussion was about transferring daycare to another department or possibly repealing the ordinance that makes it a city issue and sending it back to the state. No decisions were made on daycare except to propose the city reevaluate regulating daycare at the city level. The committee will meet next week to continue coming up with that list of recommendations. In the studio tonight, I'm Tadavik Aprikian. All right, thank you, Tadavik. Another thing the Citizens Review Committee unanimously agreed to tonight proposing interns for the Planning and Building Department.